The March for Life is um, every year in Washington D.C. There's a big rally to um, commemorate the Supreme Court decision of Roe v.ersus Wade that legalized abortion in our country. Well, the main purpose of the March for Life is to um, actually go on the march and raise awareness, I guess, and protest all the abortions. The high point would probably be there's like a March for Life rally that you go to like the night before the march. It's like a big concert and you get to be with all your friends and get excited. The, the high points of the trip are, um, you know, we, we do a lot of fun things. We have, there's a, there's a rally that we go to, um, a concert, we have speakers, but we also see a lot of the historical sites. So every year we see the museums, the monuments. You're traveling with a lot of people and you're on a bus for a very long time. And this year we had some bus problems and one bus broke down. and. One of our buses broke down and it took us like a really long time to get there and we had to fit like 80 people on like a 50 person bus. And those kinds of things kind of get a little tiresome, but all in all it's a wonderful trip. The most rewarding part about going on the march is knowing that you're standing up for the unborn and people that don't have a voice and that you're actually making a difference. The highlight for me is always the day of the march. Also, you know, in addition to kind of seeing, you know, us having fun, but to see the number of people. Anywhere between, you know, the estimates are between 150,000 to 500,000 people. Um, just a sea of humanity, and it's just, it's great, it's, it's really neat to see, and it's really inspiring to see that many people who, you know, are there to witness and for life. When I get home from school, I just love watching me some TV, like, workaholics, man, I mean, that show's amazing. What do you guys like to watch? I watch Modern Family, Spongebob. Uh... I like to watch Friends. It's a good show. I like to watch Modern Family. I like to watch The Following. I like to watch a lot of Duck Dynasty. I like to watch The Fresh Prince of Bel Air when I get home from school. I love to watch Friday Night Lights. You guys love Tim Riggins. My favorite TV show is The Real Houses in New Jersey and I watch it every day after school. My favorite TV show is Parks and Recreation. Man, everyone talking about their favorite TV shows just makes me want to go and watch some TV! It's just a little crush, crush. Like I'll fade every time we touch. So Valentine's Day is coming up and I have a lot of celebrity crushes. The biggest celebrity crush is Chris Pine. A lot of other people have celebrity crushes as well. Nina Dobrev, Vampire Diaries. AKA Elena. My celebrity crush is Isla Fisher because she knows how to take care of her man. My favorite celebrity crush is Zach Efron because he has pretty eyes. My celebrity crush is Madame Curie, the late great scientist who uh, you know, discovered radiation. She is radioactive hot. Man. My celebrity crush is Betty Crocker. Um, I think she has a great personality and I would just love to bake a cake with her. It looks like everyone around Scott has celebrity crushes. So now I'm just trying to find my shoes on the time. I'm talking to you. Hey guys, take a drink! As much as swimming is a physically demanding sport, I think it's a pretty mentally demanding sport too.
I also think it's spiritually demanding. You really have to be in tune with yourself to be a swimmer, you know? So this year we plan on making a pretty big splash in RCCs. We plan on being pretty competitive. It's one of the biggest teams Scott's ever had. So we plan on making some big waves. Oh yeah, that's right. Let's go, baby. You had a Valentine? Yeah. Really? Yeah, my grandma asked me a couple days ago. On Jared and I's first date, we went out to dinner. I know about the first date. That's bad, but I don't know. <laughs> we saw a movie. Well, our first date, I actually had a coupon to go rollerblading at skate days, so we pretty much tore it up there. Mm -hmm. I saw her busting out some great moves. I just fell in love with her at first date. Our anniversary is January 26th. Yeah. Our anniversary is December 12th. 12th. Well, actually, today is our eight days, eight days. together. My in favorite restaurant is Muscle Maker Grill. Oh my God! I brought him there. That. <laughs> that's my. chess club because it's a time to relax and get your mind off school or anything else you have during the day and it's a chance to play a game that works your mind and then yet still it's pretty fun. We just play two or three games and Tell each other what's going on and how to do better or make a better move if, if something goes wrong. And Mr. Conkins will help with that. All we see is gold. Merry Valentine's Day. Love, Chris. And Christian. Signing off. <laughs> <laughs>